welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to do the get to know me tag. Nope, invade. the invade my privacy tag, which is basically the same thing. Um, Fauna has the questions, so I'm just gonna do my makeup while she basically invades my privacy. <laughs> did you wake up cranky? I did not wake up cranky. Would you date an 18 year old at your current age? Hell no, younger boys can't do nothing for me but cause me problems, girl bye. Do you prefer to be friends with girls or boys? Um, see, if I say boys, then you're like, oh my gosh, she a hoe. But I don't know. I don't really have a preference. Like, I don't know. I have good guy friends and I have good girlfriends. So let's just say girls. Would you ever smile at a stranger? I live in China. That's all I do is smile at strangers. So, and plus I used to work in retail and they basically train you to smile at strangers. Can you commit to one person? Oh, that was a question. Yes. <laughs> oh, this is awkward. <laughs> yes, I can. I mean, yeah, I don't think it's hard. How do you look right now? <laughs> I look like my makeup is not finished. That's what I look like. What exactly are you wearing right now? I'm wearing a dress I got from Forever 21. I bought it right before I left the States and I'm pretty sure I paid like $1.75 for it. Skin tight and yeah, skin tight brown dress. That's what I'm wearing. How often do you listen to music? Every day, um, ask Spotify and they can tell you how many hours I've been listening to music. So do you wear jeans or sweats more? Jeans. I don't really have a lot of sweats. I mean, I have leggings. I don't know where we're going to throw that in there, but yeah. Do you think your life will change dramatically before 2020? It has changed a bit, I think, so far. I mean, I moved to China and I think that's a pretty big change, but anything can happen. So yeah, I definitely think my life can change even more than it has already changed. Are you an introvert or an extrovert? I'm an extrovert. Um, I don't know. I'm very good with people, at least I think I am. I do well in social circles. I'm looking at me talking myself up, but I think I'm an extrovert, okay? If the person you like says they like someone else, what would you say? I mean, I say nothing and I move on. <laughs> what is there to say? You can't change somebody's mind. Like, I don't got time for that. Do you know how many people there are in the world? Do you know? Come on, girl. Are you good at hiding your feelings? I like to think I am. But I mean, sometimes I just don't care to hide it. So if I want to, yeah, but I really just don't care sometimes and I'm gonna just let you know how I really feel. Can you drive a stick shift? In the car or on a person? Don't stop. <laughs> I can't drive a stick shift. I can barely drive a freaking automatic. Like, get out of here. Do you care if people talk badly about you? I don't think I do, but I want to know so I can know to like keep my distance. I don't want to be trusting the wrong people, I guess. I talk badly about you. I talk shit about you all the time. Are you going out of town soon? I am. Where? You know, let's not get into that. You know, just stay tuned for a vlog. How about that? When was the last time you cried? Mm, right before I left the States, I was watching Scandal. I can't even, I don't know if I'm giving away a spoiler, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Hunk got shot, lost my shit. Oh my gosh. Like, still thinking about it, it makes me so upset. <sighs> have you ever liked someone you didn't expect to? I'm sure I have, but I can't think of like a specific incident. Like people, I don't know, people change my mind a lot. You think you know someone, then you find out something, you're like, huh, you don't say. So, I'm sure I have. If you could change your eye color, would you? And what color would you want, they want it to be? Um, I used to want like different eye colors, but I'm just like, nah, I learned to appreciate mine. And like, literally, come on, look at this chocolate abyss. Like, look at this thing. Why would you want to get rid of chocolate eyes? Like, get out of here. It freaking glows in the sun. I'm happy and I'll stay with what I have. Name something you have to do tomorrow. Tomorrow's a work day. I gotta go to work. I have to teach tomorrow. So. Since we're pretty much finished with that tag, uh, she's gonna start another one and ask some more questions. 
Things you cannot leave the house without. Cell phone, even though I know it's trash right now, I can't live without my cell phone. And sunglasses, uh, like they're like black people essentials in China, high key. <laughs> Favorite skincare brand? I don't know if I have any. I think my face wash is like Neutrogena and I love it. Um, so I'm gonna go with Neutrogena. It's clean and clear, bitch. Is it clean? <laughs> I wouldn't, no. Okay, so we're gonna say clean and clear. There goes that. Favorite flowers? I don't have a favorite flower. I don't know. Hydrages? Favorite clothing stores? Stores. I love H&M. I'm not saying that because I used to work there, but um, I love H&M. I like their um, their different trends and stuff like that. It's good prices. Uh, Forever 21 is okay, but I can't, I can't go in that fucking store, man. Like, they just have too much shit everywhere. It, that's how I feel, like I feel like they're choking me. So they're good online. Favorite perfume? Uh, I have a perfume that I really love, but I can't remember the name, so I guess I don't love it that much. <laughs> so there goes that. I don't have a favorite one right now, but I feel like I want one, like I want a signature scent. Um, I don't know, it's hard to choose. At some point when you go through and like you sniff all of them, they all smell the same. But I definitely like, I don't know, I want to have like a signature set. It's weird. I feel like that's the next thing I want to get into is different perfumes. But for now, I don't have any. Converse, Vans, or Toms? None of which you own. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I don't own any of them. But um, I'm actually about to ask my sister to send me some Converses. I really do need a pair. I feel like, I don't know, they're cute and I've been wearing like black and so I don't know they go great with black so converse do you make good grades make good grades get good grades give good grades what are we talking here do I get good grades yeah. barely bitch I like got through school by the skin of my ass <laughs> the skin of my teeth skin of my ass I barely got through school okay as for giving good grades um my kids are doing fine midterms just passed you know there's hope for some of them, and let's just leave it at that. <laughs> favorite colors. A favorite color is turquoise, for sure. I do like, um, I know gold is not really a color, but I love gold. So, yeah, turquoise, gold, and black. Do you drink energy drinks? I drink Red Bull. Um, I mean, do you want to call coffee an energy drink? Sure. I love that shit, too. Do you drink juice? I do, and honestly, I need to stop. But I do. Tell them why. No one cares why. We care. <laughs> Next question. Tell them why. There is no reason why. I just don't drink juice no more. <laughs> Tell them why. My skin has been breaking out for one and I- uh, Why? What is your skin breakout called? <laughs> I have an allergic reaction. To what? Corn. <laughs> <laughs> You're so stupid. <laughs> And the thing the world is made on. I developed an allergy to corn. Everything with like high fructose corn syrup, which Wait. is everything. <laughs> Makes me fucking lose my mind. And like, yeah, crazy things happen. We'll just get into it another time. But <laughs> yeah, I love juice, but I need to stop having so much. So I've been drinking a lot of water and my skin has actually been clearing up, so. Do you like swimming? I do love swimming. Can I actually swim? gonna leave that there listen I like to float and like play in the water I feel like that should have been the question because I can't swim I'm sure if I could swim I would like it but I can't swim can black people float you racist bitch what <laughs> I don't know I heard somebody say that which racist bitch did you hear say that I think it was on TV oh god the color of your skin does not like determine what your density or do you eat fries with a fork that's ungodly. Who does that? Why is that a question? The okay. fuck? I'll take that same fork and stab you with it. <laughs> right? Oh God, no. Do you want to get married later on in life? What's later on in life? Like when I die and go to heaven later on? Or like a couple years later on? <laughs> Never later on. I'm kidding. I want to get married. I mean, I can't be a girlfriend forever or a baby mama forever. Oh, Jesus. Things like that make me cringe. Do you get mad easily? Um, honestly, it depends on what my mood is already. Like, 
I don't know if I'm in a good mood, it's, everything is fine. I'm just like, it's okay, it's not a big deal. But if I'm already pissed off, the smallest things just like make me go fucking crazy. Are you into ghost hunting? Do I look like I'm of the lighter variety of society? <laughs> Who hunts ghosts though? Of all the things to hunt, you wanna hunt a ghost? <laughs> Any phobias? Any phobias? Um, I'm afraid of Forever 21. That's a serious phobia. Man, that place is crazy. Um, I may possibly be terrified of frogs. Possibly. Possibly? Shut up. Possibly. Do you bite your nails? I do not bite my nails. Cause then when you bite it, it's just nubs and you can't even like open a can of soap. No, that's not cute either. Don't do it. If you bite your nails, stop that shit. Have you ever had a near death experience? Story time. Um, all right, all right. So it was a sixth grade, went on a class trip. I went with this girl. Well, a class trip, I went with the entire class, obviously. Miss Okulo, sixth grade class, Gardner Town. What's up? Uh, we went to like a, what is it called? Amusement park. It was Splashdown. Kids love Splashdown, kids love water. Here's the thing, I can't swim. Fast forward, we're in the lazy pool. Bitches love lazy pool. I fucking love the lazy pool, okay? I'm lounging, I'm in the little donut thing and I'm just, you know, being lazy in the lazy pool. Shit's going, I'm moving, and yeah. All of a sudden, my fucking donut flipped. Bitch, I was shook. I don't know what happened, I don't know how it flipped, but shit, it flipped, and here I am underwater, and for God knows how long, and I am dying, and I'm like trying to get back up, and I couldn't get up for the life of me. Somehow, I magically flipped back the fuck up. I don't know, God was there like, bitch, I got you. I'ma help you up. So God helped me up, right? I flipped up, and I'm like, <gasps> and my friend's like, what are you doing down there? <laughs> I was like, bitch, I was dying. The fuck you mean, what am I doing? Who goes underwater for that long? I never forget that. Like, Arminthia, if you're out there, wherever you are in the world, I was dying. <sighs> Good looking out. God help me for that one. But yeah, that's my near death experience that I never forget, I swear. Do you drink coffee? Ask that question again. Do you drink coffee? Do I drink coffee? Tell do me about I, Do you drink coffee? That's the question. I freaking love coffee. Um, it's been an experience trying to find a coffee place out here. So that was the final question for the get to know me slash invade my privacy tag. If you have any more questions, then just drop them down below. I'm always willing to answer them. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks to Afana for asking all the questions and literally interrupting every single time. Bye guys.